Hi everyone. Uh, so yesterday, uh, some of you asked uh, a very valid question. So I thought to use uh, today's video uh, to talk about that. So the question was, uh, how can we stay uh, motivated, focused? How can we perform um, while we are worried? Uh, worried about our loved ones, or worried about our family, worried in general by the situation. So. In short, I think the answer is we can't. Um, we effectively, as human beings, we are not designed um, to be able to perform in complex mental uh, tasks while we are in uh, a fight or flight mode, that is the um, operating mode that uh, our um, body is in uh, while the uh, the brain sends signals of uh, uh, of stress um, so effectively uh, we are designed in these situations uh, to respond uh, to a threat uh, the the brain sends the signal the body responds releasing uh, cortisol and uh, everything that we uh, do is focused um, to resolve the uh, critical situation. So sometimes we don't realize that because we unfortunately are, we, we are so used to uh, being stressed. Uh, but oh, of course, these situations uh, increase uh, even more uh, this, uh, uh, th this, this, this way of operating of our, uh, of our body. So what can we do? Uh, reality is that um, uh, we can't um, work on the uh, on the symptoms. So we, we can't uh, try to do something uh, about the fact that we have still to um, to work and perform uh, while we are concerned, while we are worried, while we have uh, uh, thoughts uh, about uh, uh, something that is not doing right. Um, what we have to do is to go to the root cause. Um, and the root cause is uh, understanding why uh, why we are worried uh, and uh, and why is that we have that we have these thoughts. Um, so I think the most powerful um, quote that I can use in uh, in this uh, uh, in this regard is uh, something that uh, has been uh, uh, very well elaborated by the Dalai Lama. Uh, that is. Uh, if a problem has got a solution, why worry? Uh, and if a problem doesn't have a solution, why worry? I know that sometimes hey, this seems rhetorical, but reality is that uh, this is a very important uh, shift in mindset. Um, because uh, if uh, we can do something uh, about uh, a particular problem, we should uh, act. Uh, so we should uh, transform our thoughts in actions. If we are concerned about something and we can do something about it, let's do this. So let's take the action that we have to take in order to resolve the situation. If instead is a problem that is uh, outside our control, where we can't do anything, uh, then there's nothing we can do. So we should focus on what we can control and what we can change. There's plenty. There's plenty that we can do um, uh, to change uh, um, to change uh, elements uh, that uh, are worrying us, that are under our control. Uh, there are most of these uh, are really within reach. Uh, we can change habits. Uh, we can change uh, the way in which we uh, do stuff. Uh, we can change primarily also um, the way we think and the way we act. Um, so I could talk for really a long time about everything that can be done. Uh, if you would like me to do it, we can definitely go into, into the tools, into the methods um, to, to do that. Um, but to close uh, this answer, um, I would say in summary, um, we, can't, um, we, we can't perform at our best if we are concerned, if you're worried. Um, so the best thing to do is stop for a second be mindful, uh, be self-aware, and understand uh, the root cause of the worry. Uh, then assess if it's um, something we can uh, do. Um, so can we do anything to change it or not? If we can, 
let's move to action. If we can't, let's uh, um, carry on working on, on what we can affect. Have a good day, everyone, and see you in the next video.